All right, so today is gonna start a cool, um, to me, a cool series of videos that is gonna detail what I have right here in this box. So, um, December 12th, 2020, marked my um, five years of sobriety, so I thought in uh, kind of a little gift to myself, I would buy myself a new amp kit. And uh, I went through the different companies that are out there, Mojo Tone offers some, I have an Allen Compass that I got, there's Valve Storm, which kind of helped me with some of the stuff that's in here, and I decided to go with the company that I did my last build with, which is Trinity Amps, and this right here is a Trinity Amps 18 water, and this in here is a Trinity Amps that you're about to see. Now I have mainly Marshall style amps, um, that's kind of the sound I prefer, so I have a JTM 45, JMP 50, and then this is a 18 water, and then I also have a Mesa Boogie TA30, which does Vox and Marshall and all kinds of fun stuff, and then my Allen Accomplice. So this is what I'm hoping will bridge the gap in my amp collection. Um, what I was looking for is some more of the classic sounds. And this is one of the most recorded amps in history, per the internet. And apparently it was on, used on the later Beatles albums. And one of my favorite guitar players and songwriters of all time uses this amp extensively with, I think it's called the Wizinator, Haley Off. So if you don't know what that is by now, It is a, let's get all this stuff off here, goodness gracious, 5E3 Deluxe. So this is the kit from Trinity Amps for their 5E3 Deluxe. And um, yeah, I have a George Alessandro speaker that I'm going to try to use in it first. Um, and then after, if I don't like the way that sounds, you're going to be kind of going on the speaker journey with me too, because I guess these are very reliant on what kind of speaker you're in it. And if you go online and do a lot of reading, people will go with El Nico Blues, um, different Celestian speakers, Greenbacks apparently work really well. So, um, what I'm going to do now is, now that you see this, we'll kind of take a look at some of the guts, some of the parts, and then um, we're going to go through the build process so everybody can kind of get a feel for what it's like to build a 5E3 Deluxe. Let's just talk about this cabinet here real quick. Packaging on tubes. Killer. Just killer all around packaging. This is their proprietary cabinet. Um, I was thinking about building one, but man, buying it's just so much easier. And they do a really, really nice job. The Tolex is phenomenal. And yeah, the grow cloth looks great. Nice leather handle. So, right here though, da 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 da, we have the chassis. Now we have everything kind of shoved in here. Oh, wait a minute here. The tubes are there. What's in here? I thought this was the tubes, but they got them tacked right in there. Oh, here it is. Power cord, gonna need that. Butt ton of wire, gonna need that. Here's why I buy from Trinity Amps. Even if you're an experienced amp builder, and I would never ever purport to be that, but even if you have built amps, um, I don't keep part stock a lot on hand. 
So even fishing for parts on the internet to try to buy an amp is kind of a pain. So it's really nice to just order a kit and have everything there. It's even equally awesome when you get stickers, which is fun. But this is the build dock. And this will walk you through everything. This, these are online for him too. And if you ever want to read some cool stuff about how to build an amp, and he talks about tone stacks and filtering and what things do, it's like amp kit 101 through 401. It's really cool. And then it comes with a really nice color layout for when you start, actually after you get the board together and you start doing all the wiring. It has all of the uh, layout and stuff, which is really neat. So one of, the, one of the many reasons I like using these guys, it's a father and son company, which, you know, and their stuff's great. It sounds really, really good. So, okay, build duck, awesome. Tubes, what do we got? 12YA7, 5Y3, Couple 12, it should be 112AX7 and two 6V6s, all JJ tubes, which are really nice. I enjoy those. Caps, all kinds. Here's our on off switch, standby switch, fuses, fuse holder, EIC socket, caps. Let's see, nothing is gonna be cooler than an amp that has three knobs. I'm really pumped about that. Amiibos. Oh, Super sorry. Super Mario Lego Series 2. Super Mario Legos apparently are cooler than vintage amps. How, how dare I? How dare I? We got tube sockets here, which is super cool. All right. We got the output transformer. And Input jacks, various resistors, and mounting hardware, and then this is my favorite part of building amps. Probably because I'm, I love building pedals so much, is populating a board for a, you know, a older style amp, and uh, it's really fun when you get all the components on here and you have the flying leads and everything's kind of wild and crazy and then you got to shove it in and then you're doing all this wiring and cursing a lot of cursing uh really it's just the best and then to come up with an amp that you built yourself that sounds really good which i mean i don't know how it's going to sound but i have a good idea it's a 5e3 deluxe it's probably going to sound pretty good and last but not least, we have an already mounted power transformer. And that's a hefty little darling right there. So this is going to be cool. I'm really excited. I am going to get to work tomorrow on it. Today is, I just got this in the mail today. So today is what, the 12th, bud? Uh, the 13th. Today is the 13th of January. I ordered this uh, November 30th. They had to build the cabinet, which took four weeks. They shipped it December 30th, and I just got it today from Canada, which is pretty great. Um, so now, tomorrow I'm gonna work on it. We're gonna see how far we get, and I'm gonna film, try to film every stage, take pictures, and keep everybody in the loop of what I'm doing. And uh, hopefully this gets people into the introductory of building your own killer amp. So, uh, all right, here we go.